So in level one smash ball, you catch the ball, run to the net, toss to yourself, hit it over, okay? The other team is allowed to bounce if they need it. They're gonna catch the ball before it bounces a second time, run to the net, hit it back. Okay? The team with the ball is the team to serve, doesn't matter who won the last point. So there's just one contact each time that is a smash over the net. In level two smash ball, we add our three contacts that we use in the game, which are to the net, along the net, and over the net. We're gonna catch and toss for our first contact, so it's a throw to the net. We're gonna catch and toss for the second contact, so it's a throw along the net. And then our third contact, like every stage of smash ball, is a smash, and we're gonna spike it over. You're still allowed one bounce every time the ball crosses the net. The team that has the ball is still gonna serve. Fundamentals are really important here because we're gonna start seeing tactics and strategy as we use our three contacts to move players and find different hitters. In level three smash ball, we add a second striking motion. So our first striking motion that we have for every levels is the smash when we send the ball over the net. Now we're gonna add a striking motion for our along the net contact. So it's a catch and toss to the net. We're gonna volley or overhead set along the net and then smash it over. In level four smash ball, we still only have two striking motions, but we switch our overhead set right, to a catch and toss so that our first contact can be a striking motion. And we're gonna make a forearm pass to send the ball to the net. Right, now it's a catch and toss for our along the net contact. And as always, a smash for our over the net contact. In level five smash ball, it's very, very similar to true volleyball. We have all three contacts as striking motion. So we have a forearm pass like you were just doing to the net. We have an overhead set or volley like we did in level three along the net. And as always, the smash over the net. So it's a forearm pass to the net, overhead volley along the net, and a smash over in level five. Just like our other levels of smash ball, the ball can bounce once every time it crosses the net, but it doesn't have to. The player with the ball is going to serve to start each rally. We aren't going to worry about who won the last point. We're just going to play as soon as we can. Right? And we want to have all three contacts with a smash to send it over. 